Hello AWS friends and welcome to this lesson about monitoring AWS code build. You find some metrics to monitor code build. Here straight ahead in the code build dashboard, just click account metrics. And then you can see those four metrics, builds, succeeded builds, fade builds and duration for all of your build projects. So this is global to code build in your account and region. I didn't build anything in the last three hours. So let's change the settings for the duration. And as you can see, we can find here some values. You can also add these metrics to a CloudWatch dashboard. Let's cancel this for now and do this in a second on project level. So as mentioned, this is your global metrics dashboard for CodeBelt and you can also have a look on your metrics on each project. So switch to build projects. Let's select, for example, our first project. And you can switch here to metrics. And you can see the same four metrics, but this time only for this project here. Now let's add this to the dashboard in CloudWatch. I'm going to create a new one. And now we just have to save this. We have to wait a little bit before we can see any metrics. Maybe I have to trigger a build. And here is your CloudWatch dashboard. And you find it, of course, also in your list of dashboards. And this is my dashboard for my first project. So let's trigger a build and see if we can see here any data. Going to switch back to build projects, my first project and start the build. This one is in progress and now we can switch back to our dashboard. Wait a second and refresh the data in here. And now we have some data. As you can see, we have one build, one successful build, no failed builds and the duration in here. With this less data, the representation in stacked area and line area is not this useful. Maybe let's switch to number. And now we can see these metrics for our first build project. Of course, you can also create your dashboard here in CloudWatch. So I'm going to say create dashboard, code build. And I'm adding number metrics. You find here code build. And now you can either add these metrics by project or per account and region. In this case, per account, I'm going to do this one here. And as you can see here, we have some more metrics, not only these four you can find in code build. And this is for all my code build projects. I'm going to say create widget. And now you can find this metrics and this data here on your dashboard. And of course, you cannot only view this metrics here in CloudWatch. You can also create alarms on your metrics. So let's create one example alarm for one of our metrics for code build.
and I'm going to select the failed builds. I'm going to take the sum, not the average. And I want a notification if we have more than one or better more than zero failed builds. We can select an existing SNS topic. We already created one for code commit. Now let's select this one here. and create our alarm. This is the review and I'm going to say create alarm. The alarm should be in state and sufficient at the very beginning. And if we wait a second, it should be in state OK. I paused for a minute and by now it's in state OK. If we would have a failed build, in our project, it will turn state to alarm and I would receive a notification. That's it for monitoring. Thanks for listening and see you on the next lesson.